Hello, 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 hello. How are we all doing? Right, meltdowns. That's what I had yesterday. Meltdown Monday. So I want to tell you about my meltdown. Um, what you can learn from a meltdown and why you shouldn't feel guilty about it. Okay, so last week, as you probably know, I went to the dentist to have a checkup. Um, it's all part of my cancer treatment. Um, basically, they said I had to have four teeth extracted. So the two right at the back here, two right at the back here. Um, now, I didn't ask enough questions. So when I turned up at Luton Dunstable Hospital yesterday, I'd meditated. When I got into the waiting room, um, I put on a podcast just to calm me down, just to relax me and things like that. When they called my name up, still relaxed. It was kind of, yeah, Lee, let's get this done. Let's, let's have it. Okay, it's just having your teeth extracted. And from a lot of normal people, it's quite a normal thing and they'll go ahead with it. But I had this fear. But I was calm up to that stage. I thought I was going to go into a, a little dental room with a dentist, maybe a, one or two assistants, and have the four teeth extracted. What they took me into was effectively an operating theatre. It had about seven to eight medical staff there. They were all gowned up. They were gloved up. They were masked up. And it looked actually quite scary because I just wasn't prepared for it. It looked as though they were about to perform open heart surgery on me. So I went into Mentdale. I actually, I've, I've not been that scared in a very, very long time. Um, so anyhow, they couldn't carry out the procedure. The procedure is being done this Friday, but what did I learn from it? First thing is I should have asked better questions. Whatever you get done, um, so whether it's weight loss, whether it's having your teeth extracted or whatever, ask the questions. What is going to happen? What exactly is going to happen? What is going to take place? How it's going to feel, etc. You need to be asking really good questions, well carved questions, um, especially for the type of treatment that I'm having. Um, but it applies to weight loss, it applies to a lot of things as well. Secondly, having a meltdown. I had a meltdown. Um, it happens. People take a step back. Um, that's the equivalent in weight loss. You might not meet your goal, etc. So I had a meltdown. I felt guilty about it straight after, and it did play in my mind for a good hour to two hours after, until um, I meditated again. And then I thought, you know what? This is part of life. We have these meltdowns, and we just got to go forward, and not feel guilty about it. But take what went wrong okay and learn something from it what kind of can i learn from it and that is the better questions ask questions and this is going to be the same for weight loss uh, a lot of people they go on the weight loss journey they don't ask questions they don't ask how it's going to be done what kind of weight they can lose um where they're going to be in six months where they're going to be in 12 months and that's what we're going to do we're going to ask more questions for the things we do i think Okay, so I think that's enough from me now. Um, so just take that away. It's uh, okay to have a mental breakdown or a meltdown. It's okay to learn from it. And when you've learned from it, apply what you've learned. Okay, have a great day, guys.